Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Dungeon Crawl Stone Soup. Well, let's continue with Isis, the White Draconian. On this Sunday night, I was trying to play Minecraft, but I kept getting kicked off my server. So I thought, why not record another video? A short one, as it is getting a little late. Okay, we have a couple of useless wands we have to drop here. Mm, disintegration is useful. We could drop the draining, let's drop that. I'm starting to think it might be wise to go back and visit the stash. It is a long way and we're going to lose vehement piety if we do so. But we are carrying quite a bit. Fighting is almost at 12. Let's let's make the journey. Hopefully there'll be enough uh, creatures to kill on the way. There's fighting at 12. That can go off. Channeling is decent at 12. We've got to get some spell casting and conjurations and ice magic in. This is getting ridiculous. Uh, our title is a blocker. <laughs> We're not even a caster, according to Crawl. That's unacceptable. We are a wizard. Okay, let's drop this book. And get rid of some of these rings, first of all. They're taking up a lot of inventory space. Where is our jewelry pile? Here we go. Magical power we want, but we have two of them. Let's drop that. Wizardry we want, but eh, we don't need it. Fire we can drop. Clarity we will keep, just in case. And protection. Yeah, let's keep protection just in case. We'll keep the resist fire ring as well, even though it causes hunger. Let's drop all this rubbish here. The amnesia we need to preserve. Enchant armor. Magic mapping will keep. Uh, summoning. Well, we'll use summoning. Excess food goes here. The sausage. We'll drop everything but the meat rations. Wands, potions. We can drop the potion of mites. Haste we will need. Brilliance we can drop as well. And invisibility will keep. Fan of gales. What does it do? Let's try it. Oh. It summons some uh, friendly creatures for me. That might come in handy. Our evocations is good enough to perhaps make use of that. Back to the vaults, keeping an eye on our vehement piety. Didn't go down. But we had better get to the business of killing as soon as possible. And don't forget the cannibalism. Hmm, spiders. I hate spiders. Luckily they... Oops, I can't eat them. Luckily they fall easily to my freezing clouds. And while we're at it, oh, we do have repel missiles already. Alright, not much more to do there, except back off and put up another ice cloud. That is a titan back there. Might want to just finish him off with an orb. And that does some tidy work here. Orb of Destruction is very satisfying. Uh, we'll stand toe to toe with Mo. Oh, what sneaky bastard. Um, let's target. You know what? Let's just get our friend. Let's get our friend up. He'll help us out. We 
Can we tell him to attack? Attack new target? Yes, we can. He is useful. Fortunately, he doesn't stick around for all that long. But perhaps when I get my skills up a little more, he will. I don't want to venture too far in here. We'll reluctantly kill the nice little elves. Really, I've got no quarrel with these elves. But they keep attacking me. So far, we're doing fairly well here as our white draconian. I'm pleased with the run. I think I might play more non-elvish characters. It really does make a big difference to have, uh, what is that, a titan? Minotaur. Alright, Minotaur, just come along here. Let's channel some mana. Oh, that's working beautifully. One tough Minotaur. Is he in Death's Door or something? What's wrong with him? Oh, he's a vampiric short sword. I'm gonna hit him with an orb. There we go. Good god. I should probably be a little more careful. Standing toe to toe with a Minotaur is. Perhaps not the wisest thing, and this fellow can abyss me. And I'm out of mana, so let's get our friend up. Good old Servitor, I took a step too far there. And now I'm in a heap of trouble. A heap? What is this? A ghoul? Horrible undead creature, yeah, he's pretty horrible. Uh, I think it's blink time. And they just keep coming. I was hoping to blink the other way. Let's get our servitor up. Stand back. Uh, ice the general vicinity. Tell the servitor to attack whatever the heck that is. A plague shambler. Uh, we're sick and retching. We're going to stand back once more. I'm not sure what the sickness is going to do. Okay. The Plague Shambler is dead, and that was my main concern. We're out of the Miasma Cloud as well. Um, although it is an ever-expanding Miasma Cloud. Um, let's drop some cold on him. And we're going to be forced to channel mana now. Which might not be a terrible thing. I'm going to... Okay, I was going to stand out of the way and let my servitor handle things there. Okay, let's... Uh, let's back up here. Get to relatively safe ground. Not much to worry about here. Some kobolds. I'm going to channel some mana, just so a sphinx. They're coming out of the woodwork here. I just want to get some mana back, and we're somewhat safe for now. I think I will not be reluctant. Let's get away from that miasma. I will not be reluctant to uh, use my Orb of Destruction here. Nor will I be reluctant to summon up uh, the Servitor.
They all came pouring out of here. And there's more. Somehow I managed to miss both those humans with the ice cloud. I'm marked. It's time to get back. Uh, it's time to summon a servitor. They are really coming at me in all directions, and I cannot possibly teleport at this point. We want to try and make our way north. I'm going to channel. Oh, look at them all. Difficult. Might be time to haste ourselves. That'll give us a little bit of breathing room. Oh, good lord. Let's, um, let's just take the easiest route here. And I suppose that would be south. We can have our servitor try to hold off the horde here. And we are running into the unknown. Right into an elf. Is our servitor still around? He is not. We're still marked. Oh. I forgot about this jump attack. Let's try that. Out of range. Why is that? Okay. Well, that was a good idea, but it's fairly useless now. Um, we'll breathe some frost. We're really getting low on mana, and they're bearing down on us. Let's see if we can kill this guy at least. And I just got chopped with an axe. Luckily, we're still fast. Do I have anything here? Summoning. Scroll of summoning. That helps. That is exactly what I needed. Unfortunately, we continue to head into dangerous terrain here. Oh, and I missed. We do have a scroll of blinking, so... Hmm. We can try invisibility. Most of them can't see us, but uh, the the Vault Guard and the Vault Warden can. I don't have the mana to continue this fight. I'll take another step towards the teleporter. We have Hellfire spitting at us, and we have no choice. I think we have to step into the teleporter. Our summons are rapidly disappearing. We are still invisible, so hopefully if we do teleport into a bad location, we will not instantly be spotted. Okay, that helps a little bit. First thing we're going to do is channel back mana. We'll get a servitor up. Go after the demonologist. Might be time to quaff a heal wounds. Step back. Step back. 
Please, Servitor, kill that demonologist for God's sakes. Plague shamblers. Oh, good lord. Let's read our scroll of blinking, our final one. Blink here. And it is vital to take out this demonologist. I might have to read another scroll blinking. Might be worth using the wand of fire on him. If he dies, all his summons will die and that will give me a chance. Okay, that helps a little bit. Immediately quaff our last heal wounds. Change places with the demonologist, or with the uh, servitor. We have a little bit of mana to play with, but not much. The only thing that can see us... Oh, we've got a Vault Wardens too. This is deadly. Deadly. I will read... I don't have any teleports. I thought I did. A blink. That puts us right beside a Vault Guard. What am I going to do? Another potion of invisibility. And a potion of haste. That might give us a chance. Most of them do see us. The mark is gone. We're making ground on them, but we're walking into unknown territory. Do we have a t any th way to teleport control? No, we don't. All we can do is pray we don't run into anything worse up here. And we can also flood the area with cold. Let's take this time to channel back a little bit of mana. Probably close these doors. Whew. Something's coming in, but we've recovered sufficiently. Get off an orb of destruction and an icicle. Three icicles, okay. I'm not going to fool around. I'm just going to channel my mana back. We have to be extremely careful. Let's get a servitor up and make our way back to the exit. I don't believe we've found another exit up. No. Only the initial one we came down. Okay. Very carefully. Oh, there is a vampire. Servitor, kill him. Boulder beetle. Servitor, kill him, please. Channel back some mana. Orb everything that comes at us. I'm going to channel. Good. We'll use our own breath here. The servitor's gone. Oh, Miasma. We have to stand back from that. Let's go back into our little room here. Close the door. Okay, we're rested up. The vaults has just gotten very, very dangerous. Thank God for mana channeling if we hadn't found that. Okay, here's the trouble. Ice. Orb. Orb. I don't know what that thing is, but it's got to be orbed. Just orb them all. 
and channel shadow dragon you're getting orbed too good we managed to not be drained there channel back mana and make a desperate desperate run for it Whew. two potions of heal wounds in the lair and dungeon 7 has two potions of heal wounds it is vital that we get some of those we're gonna go back up to dungeon level 7 piety be damned No, no, no. Potions of Heal Wounds, Dungeon Level 7, go. No butterflies to stop my progress, please. And what else do we have in here? Stone of Tremors, Book of Party Tricks, Magic Mapping we'll pick up. Uh, heal Wounds we most certainly will. Stones, Restore Abilities, Scimitar... Okay. That helps us out a little bit. And now I'm not sure. That, uh, that vault is deadly. Absolutely deadly. You have to be very wary of being marked. Alright, let's take another uh, crack at it here. I don't like these guys. What is he? A Hell Knight. Okay, well, that's short and to the point. Hell Knight, meet Orb of Destruction, please. At least he's edible. Alright, let's... What is that? A tentacled monstrosity. Uh, resistant to negative energy, um, poison, fire, and cold but not orbs of destruction, so that is what we will employ. He's fast as well. They just keep coming out of here. I'm marked again. Immediately move back to the staircase. Let's get up here. I'm still marked, but there we go. Okay. Hell Knight, again. At least being marked... Oh, let's get back here. It's ridiculous. More Hell Knights. This makes me suspicious that there's a unique around. Ironheart Preserver is around. Where are they all coming from? Thank God for Orb of Destruction. I'm slowed. There was a wizard there who I didn't notice. Yakchars are pouring out. I'm just going to keep orbing. We'll put Repel Missiles on. But he's dead anyway. Uh, let's let's just get upstairs. Deadly. Any artifacts? Nothing new. Any staff? Staff of Wizardry? No. Any hats? No. We have decent enough boots, I suppose. If Vault 3 is this difficult, how am I going to do the lower end of the vaults. And I 
better make sure, what is it, false 5 now? I better make sure I know where I'm going before I go any deeper. I like hanging around that teleport trap. Let's venture back into here. Throw Icicle just isn't adequate for these guys. Ooh. Treasure. Oh, am I marked again? How am I going to kill him at point blank range? Servitor, butterflies. Thank you, butterflies. Servitor, please kill him. I think I've found a pretty good combination. And it looks like we've stumbled upon some sort of hellish temple here. Let's get back before the miasma spreads. All bad potions, but one unidentified potion. Let's see what it is. Lignification. That does have some use. In a pinch, you can use that to greatly increase your armor class. And you have to stand there and tank damage. What is that? Jiangxi. A Jiangxi, a vampiric thrall bound into servitude by esoteric rituals. Through its rigid, though its rigid limbs give it an awkward gait, it moves with surprising speed, leaping upon its victims and leeching away their life essences with its ferocious. Well, that sounds pretty nasty. I think uh, let's test it against my servitor and see who wins. Well, that's one for the servitor. Now, I know I'm a, not a big fan of conjurations, or of uh, summoning. But I have to admit, the servitor is dynamite. Is that one of those marking guys? Blocking a lot of them with a shield. Channel. Eat. Very carefully eat. This is not the place where you want to uh, lapse your attention even for a moment. Nor is it the place you really want to auto explore. Bread ration there. Skeletal warrior. Holds no terror for me. that phantasmal warrior a hideous translucent green spirit of a warrior fallen in battle but recalled to this plane by unholy magic the blade it wields is ethereal passing easily through shields and armor and rendering those it strikes more susceptible to magic nasty orbum orbum again orbum until he dies Oh, what's this? The crypt. Might want to venture into the crypt. I do not have a lot of experience with it. But right now, we're focused on this level. Hello. Should have met you ages ago, and... Let's just channel here. Get a servitor up. Servitor, kill him, please. Thank you. Uh, let's eat the Minotaur. Rest up, regain hit points. Unfortunately, our Servitor is gone, but we're, we're going to keep a Servitor up pretty much at all times now. 
Servitor kill him. And he's pretty tough. He can um, stand in a cloud. What's more, I can cloud him and damage him. And uh, he won't turn on me. He's loyal. I like that. Looks like... We've almost been through here. Perhaps all the monsters have emptied out. We're marked again. Servitor, kill him. Um, Servitor's gone. Repel missiles is on. Staircases are not far away, so let's start launching orbs. Get another Servitor up. Kill him, please. Um, yes. Please kill him. I'm going to... Orb him myself. Ice Dragon Corpse. We've got a nice hide there, which of course we can't use. Let's channel our mana back. Get a Servitor up. Channel. And those Necromancers are just a joke at this point. Although I'm not willing to ignore anything in this place right now. Oh, how quaint. A Komodo dragon. As long as we keep our servitor up, and remember we have butterflies. Those butterflies will save your life. To that end, I would like to get summonings up to 10. Um, we'll leave Ice Magic on. I really want to leave Spellcasting on. We'll, we'll leave Spellcasting and Summoning on. Now we have turned into a Destroyer. We are no longer a Blocker. And that can only be a good thing. It's quite a nice title to have a Destroyer. Looks awfully good on a business card. And looks like we have finally clear, cleared out this level. Except for him. There we go. Dare I enter the crypt? Perhaps. Let's go visit the crypt entrance here. Vampire mosquitoes. Please. There it is, the crypt. I'm not sure. We'll see. We'll see next time. As for now, it is Sunday night. It's getting quite late, so uh, I better call the video here. We'll see you next time. Thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye.